Ooh, we're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Because, 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 because of all the wonderful things he does. <laughs> all right, you can come on. Okay. Risk, risk. <laughs> How's it going? It is going good. How's it going with you? Not bad, thank you. It's going all right. Yeah. Just, uh, we've had a few, well, not major hiccups. Everyone's in here, so it could be a bit sweaty at the moment. What? Well, why 61 though? Why would you do 60? We've done all those. We need to, I'm so to do 40 now. and then 61. Yeah. Yeah. Plus 40. I told you. Chaotic. Like I said, chaotic. Freeze. God. That's your scene. That's what I was telling you. The scene where he wakes up in his pajamas, but we all. Okay, yeah, we've moved that. 40 is going to there. Okay, what's 61? 61. No, 61 is the pajamas. Okay, then what's That's 40? The okay, what's 40 then? <laughs> the plan, um, the yeah. well organised plan is falling apart, guys. Um, this is the one that he got changed for. He got changed for seeing 40, didn't he? Yeah. But 60, he's in his I'm party out there. Yeah, <laughs> <my tickle down. laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, shit. How did you come to acquire the role, and how was the audition process for you? So, yeah, the auditions are quite informal and I know Fran and Tanika already who are both producing. It was fine. Getting there was a pain because it's in the middle of nowhere, raining heavily. So I turned up absolutely drenched. Um, we was really relaxed um, because I knew um, Fran and Tanika from outside um, uh, Better Fun Talking. And so I just read the Facebook invitation. I went for just a really informal chat. It was really lovely. Um, and then they were asking me about what sort of things I wanted to do and I was like, oh, well, I want to help on set. I heard about it through a friend and she just recommended it to me because she knew I was looking to do some extracurricular stuff and because uh, she was friends with Ben and Fran. So I just went along to the audition. Uh, um, it was quite short, that one, the first one. Uh, they just filmed me doing a short scene. Got a recall, luckily, and then uh, had to do a few other things, work with Alicia and Andrea, act out a few other scenes, film a few different things, do a bit of improv, and then, yeah, that was, that was basically the audition process. What was that about? I don't know. I should go seminar. Trotting to a group of friends. What is up with her? She's lying straight to my face. She doesn't have a seminar till four. I don't know. I guess this is just one of her weird days. Then got the email. Then I was made to wait outside this room for about 10 minutes. Which point I go in to read, they haven't given me one page of the script, so I'm not entirely sure what's going on. Because my lines don't really match. It was the middle page. I enjoyed it. I know um, Fran Tanika through my course, and they were advertising this strikeout project thing. It sounded interesting. So I went along to the interview. It was actually quite weird, because my interview, I think I was Rupert? Yeah. Yeah, so it's quite an emotive part, and like quite an intense scene, and uh, yeah, he's a very sincere character, whereas Ed's just a bit of a bastard, really. Well, I, I, I auditioned initially as Rupert, um, which, which, which was fine. You knew all along, didn't you? You knew there was a possibility it was Ed, and you didn't think to tell me. Well, what difference does that make? It makes all the difference in the world. This is supposed to be our project, not your party and your money. They call me back for the character of Guy, which I think was more suited to, to kind of my kind of personality. I got assigned a position of sound and it was good to meet uh, the cast and stuff like that, so yeah, it was good. You're not even joking. Anyway, last night was guys doing. Oh, don't blame it on my moron. You have very strong feelings about the guy you've met twice. Well, can you blame me? He's a prick. See, not that I'm cocky, like Guy. This is, this is going awfully. Yeah, not that I'm cocky like Guy, but I just felt like that character I could really kind of channel being a dick, because he is a dick, um, and it was, just, it was just fun playing him. So, uh, 
it's, it's quite interesting transitioning between the two because I was thinking if I got the role it would be very demanding in terms of emotion but no, I, I just get to be evil which is fantastic. As I read through the script I instantly fell in love. He, he's definitely a man after my own heart. And then, uh, but then they gave it to me, it was chill and I read some, read some words, did some uh, acting and then I got the role. And Fran told me when she was really drunk in a club, you met the smoking area, she shouted, you got a role in me. <laughs> Now, how does that surprise me? She's always drunk. <laughs> it's great. So they basically promoted to everyone, asked me to come down. So I went down and read for parts and talked about production roles. And they gave me cake and I was in. So, oh, okay. he's moving in, guys. He's moving in. Look at this. Is it the other one? Is it the ones that are more blue? <laughs> Your costume. You look pretty. I do look pretty. Yes. <laughs> Smile. Oh, <laughs> What's Fanny Franny in Italian? It doesn't exist. <laughs> My name is Francesca, but yeah. We'll say Francesca Fanny. <laughs> <laughs> Francesca Franny, no? No. No? How come you're from on Facebook? Because that's always confused me. Because that was my nickname when I was about 10. Oh. Why does people call you and France when you're from Italy? Italy? Yeah. Yeah. Olivia. Olivia. Hello? Uh, yeah, outfit four. Did I see that earlier? Do we have that in my room? I'm wearing it. This is prepared. You're wearing it. I just like. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't clock. Uh, and you're in the, the, the grey hoodie. There's a lot of uh, work that goes into doing Yeah, I'm not really sure how to do. Um, I mean, how to do this? How to do like rough and rough. Oh, put him. You're on the other side of Skype for this as well. So yeah, it doesn't matter too much if it's. No, yeah, that's true. That's true. Oh, I don't think you need to. Can you just pale him up a little bit? Pale. Yeah. Oh, pale and green. Sorry, something just had up a second. You can't. Ah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I caught that on film, everyone. Yeah. Yo. Okay. Oh, that's, that's oh, yeah. Why is he so much darker than oh. the others? Um, because he's supposed no, to be an intricate. I'm, I'm going to oh, take yeah. it off again. Okay. And also, because you have a side of Skype, it can be more like... Yeah. Menacing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm going to kill you. <laughs> what? That's not the line in the script. Store the cushion, please. Oh. Is that too dark, Fran? Wait, is that Just so it's like night time. <coughs> Try and go down. Ooh. Would you say that you were in any way like or can relate to any of the characters in Strike Out? Um, a little bit like Charlie, I guess. Charlie? I definitely Charlie. think, thank you, I was about to say. She is always acts like mum. She's the one who's trying to sort everyone else out. You know, she's kind of the motherly one, quite kind of, um, you know, wanted want to do the right thing, hard working. I definitely think I'm Charlie in the sense that I'm a bit of a bossy pants. Sometimes, most of the times. A lot of the times. All the time. She's always looking after, yeah, what's the guy um, And so I, I would probably say I was like Charlie. <laughs> guy? Guy. Rupert. Rupert. Which one is it? Rupert's Greg. Is that the one that she's still after? Rupert. This is God. <laughs> you don't even know the script. <laughs> I'm really sorry. To be fair, I think I'm a bit more chilled than Charlie. Like, Charlie is a lot. Mm. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, but not as beautiful as this. <laughs> but yeah, she's, um, so she's always looking after people and plain mum, and that's kind of my role. I'm always the sensible one, the one that's to make sure everyone's okay, the organised one. I'm not, no, I'm not, I'm not no, Charlie. No, you're, no, you're not. I'm not Charlie. Charlie. I'm not as bad as Charlie. And I would, like, I would probably be the person going, yes, let's plan this party. How does it feel? No, <laughs> <laughs> <Very special. laughs> oh, God. the first um, episode with me. Yeah, perfect. That's great. Uh, do you know the line? You get my facial reactions yeah, in this thing. Okay, thanks. Yeah, it's all in. <laughs> Very quiet set. <laughs> it's a good thing, but I mean, you can, chat, be you can chat between takes, it's fine. Okay. Oh, oh. come on. Ah! Oh my god, set some fire, guys. Quick, everyone out. Can I grab my possessions or am I not? Shit, oh, oh, oh. Get out, people! See. <laughs>
Are you bringing camera out with us? Come on guys, there's a fire. No, it's gonna take us exit to this way guys. Come on, exit to this way. Come on, Foxy Roxy. Come on, I can shit. Come on, give this an actual fire. Oh. What's your most memorable experience on set? Or yeah. most embarrassing or funny? Definitely or? showering in front of five people or so. You want to bet? Want to bet a bit? Like a <laughs> what was your most memorable experience on set? What was my most memorable experience on set? Um, I have to say, um, with Greg, when the whole kind of, um, you know, him kind of strolling around, um, like, with his shirt off. How do you yeah. feel about it, Olivia? No, I have it's a bit intrusive. It. You weren't joking when you said you're going to be shoving that in people's faces. <laughs> Was it awkward for you doing like constantly doing I, changes and yeah, yeah. brushing your teeth? And I, I was like acting like I, I was fine with it, but I was dying inside. Like, because <laughs> he, he, he kind of could sense it was a bit like, oh, we're too invasive here. Yeah. Oh, Roxanne. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit intrusive, isn't it? <laughs> that was that was kind of interesting. I felt like I felt like there was a moment where I felt like we were shooting a porno. It'd be okay if I was like a big gym head, but I'm not the buffest guy in the world. <laughs> so it wasn't, it, no, it was a good laugh, but <laughs> that was Had to be done, had most to be embarrassing. done. First day, just everyone kind of getting to know each other, and actually, was it first or second day? But Greg having to be in the shower, and everyone <laughs> cramming oh, yeah. into my bathroom, and having to <laughs> try and. Not gonna lie. The water was just going everywhere because we didn't have a shower. That was also, I think, the first genuine laugh on set when he just turned around and said, This feels like a porn film. Yeah. I think yeah. that's when. And it was just, a nice moment, yes, it started it kind of clicking there, because Making that's when we went, we really went over just from like. <laughs> Ben's died, everyone. What are we gonna do? <laughs> oh shit! Oh, oh, that that so I gotta have this. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah. so <laughs> I'm not happy. Oh, Fuck it. This is put us behind schedule, ain't it? There's nothing illegal about filming. <laughs> You're famous. Oh, shit. <laughs> you, 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 you falling while you're trying to get out the door. Panic, fire alarms going off, everything, you know. Oh my god, everyone's looking at me. <laughs> so this is all in the behind the scenes footage. That's Jamin, he plays Jake. Hi. Hi Lulu. Hi. Meet Foxy Roxy. <laughs> I'm, I'm making nicknames for everyone. Sorry. I'm wondering what's going on. What have I got in here? <laughs> There's your script. <laughs> There's the missing script. Inside your the script laptop. Ben, he's lost, but we're not going to tell him. I'm just going to drop it somewhere. Oh, you naughty girl. I didn't do it on purpose. Oh, it's my little chunder monkey. Yeah. Everything's slow, deliberate. He's a bit slow. <laughs> 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 Rock sounds stressed. Oh, okay. See you later. Bye. Bye. Did we do the fourth one? Oh, fuck! <laughs> Not on the way in, too! Come on! <laughs> I yell at them! Uh-huh! <laughs> <laughs> At least, yeah. Her alcoholism is, um, a terrible... <laughs> she just hit me. She does that. And she said that if I told anyone, she'd hit my mum. Speakable! <laughs> Oh my
open. I just opened my computer. Ah! <laughs> uh <laughs>